And welcome back to KSN News at Noon. Time to take a walk on the wild side. Joining us today from the Great Plains Nature Center, this is Amanda Alisi. Amanda, thank you so much for coming in. And today she brought with her something very timely with <laughs> Halloween right around the corner, a tarantula. Yes, a Texas brown tarantula. Okay, tell us a little bit about the Texas. He must be from Texas. I want to know if they're any native to Kansas. They though, are, too. yeah. So the Texas brown tarantula is um, also known as the Oklahoma brown tarantula and the Missouri tarantula, but they're found in Kansas too. So they are in the southern parts of Kansas. They like arid, dry areas. Just hitch a ride. Yeah. Get up here. How they get? How they get up here? Um, I mean, they they live in the drier areas of Kansas in the southern parts, so they they'll walk. Okay, and yeah. this one is unnamed. Correct. Okay, yeah. that's fine. How many tarantulas yeah. you have out there? This one. This is just that one. Yes. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, Oklahoma. Yeah. Missouri and Texas. It is the largest tarantula, or the largest Kansas spider. And it's not it's one that Texas you want to handle. Um, I don't recommend handling it. They are. Um, Fairly docile, I don't recommend it either. I but no, I'm not going to handle it. If they do get upset, they can turn around and shoot some of their hairs, <laughs> projectile them into you, and they See? can they can inject like stay into you. So, so be yeah, safe. We're gonna we're be gonna safe keep around her the tarantulas. right here. <laughs> okay, I guess I got Halloween coming up. Uh, yes. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah. So Halloween at the Great Plains Nature Center this year, we're getting batty for Halloween, um, and so we're gonna have lots of really cool bat education things and some other you know we like to help you understand some of these creepy crawly creatures that are misunderstood and so that's yeah. what we do at halloween we're also going to have a costume contest and a uh, local artist lauren miller is going to be there with some of her creations that help dispel myths and help um, people not be so afraid of bats okay so again that is saturday october the 22nd yes. from one to four it's a free event you can learn about all things bats art, activities, costume contest, uh, and lots of activities. So get out there and enjoy it. Learn about bats. You can even meet uh, Harry the Tarantula. Yes. <laughs> All right. Thanks so much, Amanda, for coming in today. We'll be right back. Thank you.